In a world where craft beers are gaining rapid popularity, how does Heineken, one of the globe's most iconic beer brands, maintain its position at the forefront of the industry? This is a summary of Heineken. The story of Heineken starts in the heart of Amsterdam in 1864, where a young and ambitious Gerard Adrian Heineken acquired a small brewery named De Hoiberg. Fueled by his vision of creating a beer that would be loved the world over, Gerard embarked on a quest for brewing excellence. Heineken started becoming famous worldwide around the end of the 1800s. Winning a gold medal at the Paris Exposition in 1889 was a big deal for them. It showed that people all over the world liked Heineken beer. In the 1900s, Heineken made a strategic move by anticipating the end of prohibition in the United States. This foresight allowed it to be one of the first beers available in the U.S. when alcohol sales were legalized again. The mid-20th century marked a pivotal era for the company under the leadership of Freddie Heineken, the founder's grandson. Freddie was a visionary, and he brought a fresh, modern approach to the brand. It was during this time that Heineken became known for its iconic green bottle and red star logo, symbols that today are recognized worldwide. Freddie also focused on marketing and advertising, helping Heineken become not just a beer, but a symbol of social enjoyment and quality. The company's growth accelerated as it began to acquire other breweries and expand its beer portfolio, solidifying its position as a brewing powerhouse. By the end of the 20th century, Heineken had established itself as one of the leading beer brands in the world, a status it continues to maintain through a commitment to quality innovation, and the art of brewing. With the start of the 21st century, Heineken began focusing more on being environmentally friendly and responsible around the world. The company worked hard to use less water and create less pollution in making their beer. Lately, Heineken has been encouraging people to drink alcohol in a safe and sensible way. They are doing more than just making good beer. They are leading the way in promoting a healthy approach to drinking. But Heineken has not only received positive news throughout its history. The company faced significant criticism for its slow exit from Russia during the Ukraine conflict. This decision, taking around 18 months to complete, resulted in Heineken incurring a major financial loss as they sold their Russian business for just one euro, totaling a loss of 300 million euros. The delayed withdrawal was a complex process with Heineken aiming to protect its local employees while also trying to act ethically in a politically sensitive situation. Heineken's financials over the past years reflect a dynamic market environment. A notable dip in turnover and profit was seen during the COVID-19 pandemic, which affected the global beverages industry due to lockdowns and restrictions on social gatherings. This impact was temporary, and Heineken has been working on recovery and growth strategies since. For future profit growth, Heineken is focusing on several key areas. One, expanding its premium beer segment, which typically offers higher margins. Two, enhancing its digital presence and marketing strategies to reach a broader consumer base. Three, investing in sustainable practices, appealing to a growing demographic concerned with environmental impacts. Four, diversifying its product range to include non-alcoholic beverages and other alternatives tapping into new consumer trends. Heineken's ability to adapt to changing market conditions, innovate in product development, and capitalize on its strong global brand presence are crucial factors for its future financial performance. Heineken's journey to becoming one of the world's largest beer producers has been beneficial for its investors, marked by consistent growth and expansion. With its strategic focus on premiumization, sustainability, and digital innovation, Heineken has shown resilience and adaptability in a competitive market. However, the critical question for investors and market analysts now is, how much further can Heineken grow and can it maintain its momentum in the face of evolving consumer preferences and global market challenges?